If all of your friends were to jump off a bridge, would you do it? No. No. Is there like a bungee cord attached to them? Probably. Definitely. <laughs> yes. And why is that? I'm just not somebody that could ever or would ever kill myself. It depends. So like, I still have family and stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah, so then I could just, you know, like, cope with them and like hang out with them. I don't know if I'd want to live with all my friends. Being in like a friend group is one of the most important things to me and I can't imagine not having that friend group around. To do something so courageous and adventurous with the people you love the most. When you think of the question, what do you think of? Like loneliness. Why would they jump off a bridge? Why wouldn't they? Growing up, it's something that I've heard like, oh, you just have to do what all your friends do. It's, it's sort of like a question in like punishment. The fear right before you jump, the realization that you committed to it, and the pride you have in being able to overcome that level of fear. A lot of adrenaline, exhilarating, and just feeling like there's no boundaries. You don't feel anything because you're falling. And it's just kind of feel the air rushing up, and it's an adrenaline rush, and I think that's definitely one of the reasons why it's something to do with friends. If all your friends did this, would you too? It depends, like on the motive. There's no one answer. It's like, would you, would you, uh, you know, would you sit down? It's like, am I sitting on a bear trap? I don't see it as it, like copying someone. If you consciously make the decision to do, to jump off a bridge, and if your friend does that, then that's still your decision. If you're touching nothing except air, and for the few seconds that you're you're falling, it's like freeing. People can give you that feeling, and I think it's really necessary because it's it's that exciting shock that you realize why life is so exciting.